Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Johnny Nix, and today I want to talk about something that has the internet in a swirl. The biggest YouTuber in the land, of course PewDiePie, plans to delete his channel sometime tomorrow after garnering over 50 million subscribers, and I guess a sort of protest towards YouTube's new policies slash issues, I, I don't really know. And as usual, whenever one of these mega channels does something out of left field like this, other YouTubers must react and chime in with their thoughts on the YouTuber in question and their actions. The important question I'd like to raise is, honestly, who cares? Before anyone responds saying, oh, you're making a video about this, so obviously you care, let me be clear that the focus of this is less about PewDiePie and more about why others are so invested in what someone else does when it doesn't really affect them. For instance, many are calling the guy out saying that this is a publicity stunt. He's going to make a new channel after deleting his current one, probably, so what's the point? And to that I say, yeah, so? If you're one of these people making a video calling him out for just being desperate for attention, then my question to you is, what exactly are you doing? You're giving him said attention so that you yourself can also get attention by talking about this popular subject? I mean, do you see the hypocrisy here? And I get that it's cool to hate on PewDiePie, right? He's made more money on YouTube during this sentence than most of us ever will. The success of others is always easy for us peons to rally against. And he's done so by being a wacky guy with some pretty childish humor. I mean, I'll go as far to say that I'm not a fan of his videos, like at all, but that doesn't mean I have some sort of problem with him as a person, or even said videos. Shit, if someone told me tomorrow that I could make the same sort of money that he does doing the exact same shit, I'd do it in a heartbeat. And sorry to all of those on their high horses about, oh, I make more mature content, or whatever, but so would most of you. Yeah, everyone says it's so easy to do what PewDiePie does and get a huge following, right? Well, then why the hell don't more people do it? Because they'd look like idiots when they inevitably fail like the thousands of unknowns who have tried to copy him and those like him over the years. So yeah, getting back to the whole deleting his channel thing, like I said, who cares? If you're someone who doesn't watch or follow the guy, this doesn't affect you. Anyone who thinks this grand stand against YouTube is going to shake everything up is kidding themselves. As while he is incredibly popular, it's not like him going away would change much about the overall YouTube landscape, and from what I've heard, that's not even what's happening, he is, as he does plan to make another channel. As far as his issues that he's mentioned with his whole view and subscriber counts, which I guess have been raised by other YouTubers as well, that's for them to decide how they want to handle it. People go off about this as well, saying things like, Oh, you already make a ton of money. Does it really matter if you're making a little bit less? Well, yeah, it matters to them. If you think of your YouTube channel like a business, as many of these people do, as it grows, you expect to make more money, not less. It's as simple as that and the possibility of achieving similar success is what drives us, the small businesses, to work hard as well. In the end, everybody who makes videos, or I guess content, right, that's what we do these days, we're all content creators. Everyone who does this wants to get views on their videos, they want people to subscribe to their channel, and as you get more views, as you get more subscribers, guess what? You end up wanting even more. That's the way we're wired, people. Greedy as fuck. And as time goes on, people are going to experiment and find new ways to bring attention to themselves. And that's what I see PewDiePie doing here. And so far, so good, because everyone is talking about this. And I guarantee if he does go through with this, many of those same people will go on to cover his new channel as it grows. And hell, maybe somehow this brings even more eyes to him than he had before. Simply put, if you don't like it, don't help him by putting the eyes of your viewers and followers on this by bringing attention to it. But that'll never happen. People will continue to rage and slam this guy as an attention whore 
as they fight for the space nearest the spotlight shining on the situation in hopes of gaining more attention towards themselves. God love ya, you bunch of hypocrites. And with that, this video's a wrap. Remember guys, this is YouTube. Let's not take it too seriously.